two Goliaths and 12 Davids come to Nashville for the 2018 SEC Women's Basketball Tournament. South Carolina is the three-time defending champions. Mississippi State is undefeated this season. Let's go. Right here. Intentionality is one of the things where we're very intentional right now. Let's have a good, good focus today, okay? Together. One, two, three. Together. They put in their time and effort at practice, working to overcome whatever their opponents will throw at them. You tried to come up here, up all here, and she went here. You got to come out with it, okay? Mississippi State has it all this year. The winning streak, <laughs> the talent, the coach with the pedigree. Again, focus, eliminate distractions. What's our goal? To get to that game tomorrow night and not walk off the floor when the confetti's coming down. You're going to have to play really well today. There we go. Let's go. Beat Texas A&M three. One, two, three. Beat Texas A&M. It's the SEC tournament. It's March Madness. It's all begun. As we get set for this opening tip-off of semifinal Saturday game one is between the fifth-seeded Aggies of Texas A&M and your number one seeded Mississippi State Bulldogs. Keep Mississippi State's threes to a minimum. That's what they feed off the crowd. They're going to have three to 4,000 fans, and we're going to have 75 to 100. That's all we need. We got five. They got five. That's all. We got five. They got five. I love it. OK? I love it in that challenge. We're going to show up today with all the fire and the energy that they've ever seen. We're going to make mistakes. We're going to make turnovers. We're going to uh, lose our man. We're going to, but guess what? So are they. So are they. We got an opportunity to win another championship. This is the next team in the way. That's it. That's all there is to it. That's the way you've taken it all year. You've been so good at focusing and eliminating the distractions. You've worked your tail off all your career and never get to this point. So here's what I'm going to tell you. Go enjoy the moment. Let's go. Bulldogs stay together and play with teamwork. Texas A&M coach Gary Blair knows that Mississippi State wins with relentless passing and efficient offense. Top of the key, hands it off to Schaefer, doesn't have a shot. Schaefer, top of the key, zips it inside to McCowan, left block. McCowan back out to Schaefer, bounce pass to Johnson. She's over, left wing, three on the way, go! Vic Schaefer has faith in his team and in the leadership provided by his daughter, Blair. But when the Aggies flex their muscles, the Bulldogs cower. Outside shot, and the Kennedy show is off three. Carter, now top of the key, splits two defenders, now feed a roll with the right hand, oh. <laughs> Carter keeps shooting, keeps hitting. Carter is just chewing this Bulldog defense up. You guys are just getting butt, your butt kicked right now. I'm not going to scream and holler at you. You either fight back or we'll get beat 20, if that. Right now, you're seeing AM get all the hustle plays. Nine rebounds already to three for Mississippi State. Part of the Texas AM plan for victory is physicality. Work harder and stronger. The Aggies are winning the boards. Crushing Mississippi State on the boards right now. Go, 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 go! I don't know that there's anybody better in the game at attacking and finishing with contact. We're standing on offense, the ball sits in our hands. We're not playing hard, you're letting them come off screens, not good hedges. We're soft on the ball, Mo. You're letting her just do what she wants to do. But then, 
We're getting our butt kicked rebounded. She just shoves you under and you don't fight. If the three is open, go ahead and take it. Offensive board, we got a long way to go. Skills and aggression help number three, Kennedy Carter, win SEC Freshman of the Year. I don't think there's any doubt about it. If you don't re didn't realize it before, you better know now. You're in for a, in for a dog fight. Kennedy Carter works with it on the right wing. Go between the circles. Morgan Williams going to be right there on her. Now she picks up her dribble, and it's going to be knocked out of her hands, and it's going to go over the end line. And then Morgan Williams just comes and picks it up. She'll take it to the basket, puts it off the window, and in good from the left side. Vivians. She can score in a variety of ways. And that's what makes her so tough to defend. Victoria Vivians has been here before. She sinks three straight threes in the second half. And Mississippi State goes up by 19. To Jasper Holmes, now to Vivians, right wing, she'll fire for three, and she battled it in good. What a beautiful shot. They were down 18 to 10, and since then, it's been the Bulldog Show. Hey, I'm proud of you guys. All right? I'm proud of you. So let's just keep fighting to the dog on it and do it with class. Listen, we're going in that dressing room as a team, as in one. All right? You're a damn good team. They're number two in the nation. Give them credit, but let's see how much fight we've got left. Lumpkin on top of the lights and loops it inside, intercepted by Tierra McCallum. It's five on four basketball right now. Shake! This crowd is going to get really loud. Bulldogs are going to oust Texas A&M for the second straight year of the semis. The sophomore now junior. One more. Yeah. Let's go. Here we go. Together on three. One, two, three. Together. But ladies, we got to find a way to be better tomorrow for sure. Okay? Great win. Great win. Another top 25 win, top 15 win. That team's going to be a top four seed in the tournament. Got to get ready now for a, a real good one. Great job. No. earn yours this year for a reason. And you've done that. You have done that starting in the summer, starting in the preseason, in the fall, and now you have earned the right to be here. We're playing in the semifinals. Have you ever done that? Haley, have you ever done that? We're playing in the semifinals, guys. You've earned it. So now expect to win. Expect to win. They expect to win. They're trying to get this march so they can compete for four in a row. That's what's on the line for them. They're competing to get four SEC championships in a row. We haven't won an SEC championship since 2001. It's time. It's time, ladies. Be determined to win. Georgia well on its way to getting right back with the elite of the elite, looking for a major victory and a big upset here tonight against the defending national champion, South Carolina Gamecocks. The tip is up and we are underway. The Bulldogs have not reached the tournament finals in over a decade. They have what it takes to beat the champs.
Hugh for a three. That's good. Hugh Morris is feeling it early. Tasha drops it off for Mack. Right low block, yes! Offensively, we got really good movement. We're crashing the glass. Yeah. Just continue making the extra pass. We'll get it, OK? Yeah. We'll get it. We've got good movement. And when we rebound it, push. Georgia takes the early lead, but the Gamecocks soon unleash number 22. Wilson through traffic, up and under, foul line, jumper, good. Wilson, dribble drive, turn around against Ingram, good, and a foul. No stopping that one. Wilson, give it South Carolina its first lead. She is truly the difference maker. Three across! Three across! Right wing Jackson, right low block, Asia Wilson, powers it up, good. Asia's got nine, and South Carolina leads 13-12. Three times the SEC's Player of the Year, unprecedented. Okay, okay. It's fine, it's fine. Here we go. Good. That's good. You're fine, baby. You're good. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, here's how they get back in the game. Okay, here's how they get back in the game. Offensive rebounding. Okay, turnovers, live ball turnovers in the transition points. That's how they get in the game. Okay, how we do it? We got box out, and we can push the ball on them. We just have to remember. You know, that they're they're going to double you guys, whether you're in the post or or dribbling. Yeah. So you, ha you, you got to take dribbles that are towards the basket. Any flat dribble, they're right there. They're right there. So kick it, get it back, and then we can go. The Gamecocks never trail again. and they're going into their post players. SEC Women's Basketball Championship game. Two teams at the apex of excellence. We are at Nashville, Tennessee. We are getting set for the championship game of this 2018 SEC Women's Basketball Tournament. The top two seeds from the regular season, South Carolina, the defending national champions, get ready to take on Mississippi State in what is a rematch of last year's national championship game. South Carolina has already won a record 11 straight games in the SEC tournament, dating back over the last four years, and have won the first the last three SEC tournament titles including the last two wins coming over Mississippi State. Today is about toughness. It's about resilience. Resilience. To be able to, be able to come back 
You can have runs today in games. They're gonna have a run, we're gonna have a run. We gotta stop their run and then we gotta have another run. Resilience, back to back to back. You gotta be resilient today to get through another tough, physical, aggressive basketball game against the top 10 basketball team. That is absolutely the most physical team you've played all year. You walk out there, you turn into a monster. You forget how nice and sweet you are, because if you don't, it ain't gonna be pretty. You're playing for a championship today. You better have the mindset of, hey, I gotta go take it. I think we've been in this game before just hoping. No, we're gonna go take it. You're gonna have that mindset today. Each one of you, you're gonna do your job and you're gonna go take it. They have met in the last two championship games and in the last national championship. The defending champs against the undefeated. When this game is done, one team's streak will end and one team's reign will continue. Southeastern Conference Tournament Championship game is underway. The third straight year these two teams have battled it out. We're underway on Championship Sunday here in the Music City. The last team that beat the Bulldogs was their opponent right now. Early on, the momentum of 32 straight wins is gone. Badly. The Bulldogs are really struggling from the floor. No score two minutes in here on Championship Sunday. Maybe some yips on both sides. Air ball and a barely a rim. Underneath the Bianca Jackson to lay it up and in. And the game got to 34 and 2 nothing. With 7-13 to play in the opening quarter. It took a while to work the weight. Bianca Jackson starts the scoring for the game cops. Oh, it's going to bounce to the Victoria Vivian's right side. Vivian's didn't have a shot. McCowan, 15 foot on the way, and rattles in the floor. Tierra McCowan with a mid range jumper to tie the game at two apiece. Well, it's, it's been a struggle offensively for both teams right now combined, just two of 11. I love this game because of the chess match going on between the coaches. Just like I showed you on film. Just drive the ball. Don't settle. Drive it. Listen, we need shots at the basket. We need shots at the basket. I don't care if you go down there and pull up. Pull up right in their face. We can't retreat. We can't retreat when they're bringing this ball down the floor. Can't guard us. But we don't need to settle. Just don't, I mean, I've been coaching some of you four years, and I keep coaching you about this. You just settle. You won't be aggressive. Get your man in the air, drives the right lane, and puts it up and in. Back and forth we go. And we throw the ball away, but it carries to Kiki. She pulls up from the baseline and nails it. 15-footer for Kiki, and the Gamecocks with their largest lead of four points at 12 to eight. Wilson got key position on Campbell, and then it's kind of runs out from there. Yeah, you cannot allow Wilson to get that deep on the block. Herbert Harrigan has a hot hand. Staley in South Carolina, you know where they want to go, always to the inside. In the corner, Jackson will launch a three. Bang! Three pointer, Bianca Jackson, the freshman with her 36th of the year. Big three by Bianca Jackson. She's got five points. Here's it. Looking, looking now, puts it on the floor, drives it. Trucks over Blair Schaefer, they're going to call the block. Oh my goodness. And we're going to get blocking foul on Blair Schaefer. Count the basket, chance 
for a three-point play. Schaefer, who's been known to flop and takes a lot of charges with those flops, didn't get the call this time, and for Danny, Nick Schaefer isn't happy about it. When these teams played in the regular season, Mississippi State rallied from 12 down. State just threw 12 now. 25%. Drives it. Herbert Harrigan drives it towards the band. Lay the win. Lay yeah. the win. Yeah, Lay right. the win. Lay the win. We're not gonna hold on. Okay, mm -hmm. we're gonna take this lead to to 20 yeah. and 30 yeah. and whatever. Yeah, go. We have to defend the three-point line. Okay, they got a run in them. We gotta defend the three-point line. Make them to us. Make them to us. To us. Run them off the line. We gotta capitalize on on opportunities, and we we didn't. But we got another we got another two quarters to do that. Together on three, one, two, three. Together. Together. Here we go. In the second half, the Bulldogs do what they must to extend their win streak to 33. See, they have the screen, much needed. And the Bulldogs have just closed the gap a little bit. It's now 32-24. Morgan William left side around the screen, steps into an 18-footer and buries it. William, the little one comes up with another big shot. Shot clock in the single digits. Goes top of the circle to Morgan William. Drives it. Bump. Puts up the 14 for Good. Morgan William with 10 points. Back to back buckets for Morgan William. It's a five point game again. Number 22, Asia Wilson leads the Gamecocks back to a double-digit lead. Asia Wilson! What a finish! Clock ticking with 2.13 to play to Jennings. Working against a couple of defenders, puts it up and in. Big bucket by Alexis. And the Gamecocks lead 60 to 49. Eight seconds to go, the Gamecocks have it. The Gamecocks are gonna do it. And South Carolina makes history. The first team to win four straight SEC tournament titles. And Mississippi State's perfect season is no more. For the fourth straight year, the SEC tournament trophy shines in Columbia. For South Carolina, the word champion is no longer enough. I'm happy for our players. They're so resilient, and they were so full of belief, fighting, fighting for history. You know, we will go down as the only team right now to have won four SEC tournament championships. They are now a basketball dynasty.